What's up, you guys? Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Layla Lynn TV. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you go ahead and subscribe and click the bell so that you're notified of every new episode that I post. I knew yesterday that when Sanaa Lathan denied biting Beyonce that she was lying. I made a video of Sanaa and Sarah Foster denying that they were the one that bit Beyonce. So click the link to watch that video if you need to catch up. But yesterday, Sanaa tweeted, y'all are funny. Under no circumstances did I bite Beyonce. And if I did it, it would have been a love bite. And I knew as soon as I saw the part, if I did it, that she did it. Anytime someone makes up scenarios like if I did it, they usually are the one that did it. OJ Simpson is a prime example of that. Well, today, sources close to Tiffany Haddish have shared with TMZ that Tiffany confirmed to them that it was definitely Sanaa Lathan. TMZ reports, multiple sources tell TMZ Tiffany Haddish has told multiple people that the culprit is Sanaa. One source said it was not an aggressive bite, it was playful and non-invasive but still caught Beyonce off guard. The story goes, Sanaa was talking to Jay in a way that made Beyonce uncomfortable. Beyonce went over to Sanaa who brushed off any insinuation of inappropriate conduct and then gave her a jokey bite. Tiffany told Beyonce she was going to kick Sanaa's behind but Beyonce told her to let it go. So now probably feels like it's okay to flirt with Jay-Z because he mentioned her name in his song Lucifer where he says flyer than Sanaa Lathan. So she knows that he thinks she's attractive. But still Sanaa, you gotta do better. You cannot get high and then flirt with the husband and bite the wife when she confronts you. You cannot do that Sanaa. You guys leave a comment and let me know what you think about Sanaa Lathan being the one that actually bit Beyonce.